crook. Some clubs can do it. OK, well, let's get some reaction. And there are clubs desperate to win it. Let's hear from the man at the top, Ferran Soriano. He's talking to Matt Smith. Matt. Ferran, let me ask you then about the draw. Are you happy from a Manchester City point of view with the teams that you will be playing in the Champions League this season? <laughs> I guess you can never be completely happy or unhappy with uh, the with draw. But yes, I think we have good teams to play. It will be great to go back to Sevilla. Yes. Last time we went there was 2015. Even Copenhagen, we were there in 2009. And of course, Dortmund, we were there recently. But it will be a special game, especially for Erling Haaland, Erling Haaland and for Ilkay Gundogan. Sometimes it feels like the fates bring teams and players to certain places. And for Erling, I guess this, yes, these you two can, matches will be very important. You can count on it. You can count on this, on this fate. But I think both will enjoy it. This is a, it's a fantastic stadium. Uh, last time we went there, it was empty because of COVID. So it's, it will be actually a great experience for fans, both in Dortmund and in Manchester. So we're very excited. It's inevitable you'll know most of the teams because you're in the Champions League every season. That's one of the reasons Manchester City are such a growing force in this competition in Europe. Is it the number one priority, do you think, for the club this season, this competition? No, it's never. It's never. Our, our priority is always the Premier League. This is, we work for it every day. This is our bread and butter. And the Champions League, of course, it is an, an aspiration, but it's not an obsession. We will win it, I am sure. I like that confidence, don't you? I love the way he said bread and butter. <laughs> I just love that. <laughs> Let's talk about one of their opponents, Sevilla. What sort of shape are they in coming into this new Not season? great shape. No. They, they sold Jules Koundé, of course, to Barcelona. Diego Carlos has gone to to uh, Steven Gerrard's Aston Villa. Unfortunately, got a terrible injury. Um, they haven't replaced them, really. They've just brought people up from within the camp. They haven't brought anybody else in. They brought a few players in, but they've started La Liga um, very slowly. So I don't think... Uh, Manchester City have got anything to worry about. Let's see if they bring any players in in this last week. But starting La Liga, they've really struggled severe. OK, well, there you go. We heard from Ferran Soriano telling us that they will win it at some point. Maybe it will be this season. Who knows? We've also spoken about Rangers brilliantly in the Champions League.